If you're looking for some weekend entertainment, good news, the carnival is coming to town, although it might not be in the way you're expecting. The Saskatoon Symphony Orchestra is putting on the Carnival of Venice on Saturday night. It will be an outstanding performance, and today I'm so happy to be joined by principal flutist Allison Miller from the Saskatoon Symphony Orchestra. This show is going to be exciting for you, Allison. We'll get to that in just a minute, but before we launch into this performance specifically, just talk a little bit about what the last year or so has been like for yourself and your colleagues with the Saskatoon Symphony Orchestra as, well, pretty much everything in the world has been entirely different. Absolutely. Thank you so much for having me. It's been uh, quite the adjustment. You know, we are observing safety protocols all around. We're distancing within the orchestra, wearing masks for instruments that are able to do so, um, hand sanitizers everywhere, physical barricades when we're able to do that. Um, but despite all those protocols, it's so fantastic to be able to perform during this time. I know there's countless musicians across the country, across the world who aren't able to do that. And so we're extremely privileged to be able to perform consistently at this time. Yeah, of course, that's uh, one of the, the big things about becoming a musician at this level is you want to be able to do it in front of audiences. Absolutely. Great that these live stream performances are, are continuing for the Saskatoon Symphony Orchestra. And this one coming up on Saturday is especially exciting, as I mentioned off the top. This is your first solo performance. So what does that mean for somebody like yourself? And, uh, and what, what can people expect from the show itself? Oh, it's very exciting. Uh, this is my first uh, solo performance with the orchestra, second season overall playing principal flute. Um, I'm so excited. I'm from Saskatoon originally, born in the city up until high school. And uh, this concert in general is so packed with ornate details and expressive lines and everything that we as musicians love to incorporate into our art. Outstanding. And uh, in addition to performing, playing with the, the Saskatoon Symphony Orchestra, you also uh, keep yourself busy by teaching music, which is, of course, also <laughs> changed dramatically, I imagine, over the last year or so. But you do teach at the University of Saskatchewan, and the two worlds are actually kind of coming together. Talk a bit about how this performance coming up and, and perhaps other performances that you've done, you, you actually use these as, as teaching tools for your students. I do, yes. Um, I'm the sessional lecturer in flute at the University of Saskatchewan. And uh, I started this year with 100% remote teaching. So every one of my lessons so far has been distanced in a safe manner. Um, and we've been doing those online. And part of the, the fantastic thing about transitioning to having this online presence with the orchestra is the fact that I can reference things that I'm doing in my lessons. Students have the opportunity uh, to watch those concerts, to see some kind of specific technique in action, and to um, really kind of get a, a different perspective on performing. I think sometimes uh, they're not able to attend concerts live in person and with the 24-hour ticket that the SSO is selling, they're able to accommodate that no matter how busy their schedule may be. And once again, the show coming up on Saturday is the Carnival of Venice. It is different, obviously, because it is online it's you're not there in person but i think the things i've noticed from from other performances like this is uh there is still that excitement there's still that buzz because you know you're watching something live you're you're a part of something that's actually happening so while you might not actually be there in the venue it's uh, it's still a pretty cool thing to witness Absolutely. And I think that's one of the joys of live performance, having the one opportunity, whatever happens in the moment happens, you're able to kind of follow your inspiration. And even if you're not there in person, you know that your musicians are playing with every ounce of their heart in that moment. And if folks want to take part in this Saturday's show, the Carnival of Venice, SaskatoonSymphony.org is the website to visit. Alison Miller, thanks so much for spending a few minutes with us today. Thank you for having me.